What does God require of you? Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever thought that when you pray, asking God, well, God, what do you require of me? In Micah 6, verse 8, it has the answer. God has showed you, oh, what is good, and what does the Lord require of you? Here it comes. But to do justice and to love kindness. So you are to do justice. You're to love kindness. You look for and appreciate every evidence of justice, mercy, and faith in your consciousness in your awareness. As you feel your oneness with God, you can look for and praise all that is just, all that is merciful, and all that adds to the faith that you are learning to express every single day. As you feel your oneness with others, you look for and praise all that they do which is just and merciful and all that contributes to a strong faith of us all. You begin to promote that that is justice, that that is kind. You look for and appreciate every evidence of justice, mercy, and faith. And in small everyday happenings, you praise the spirit of justice that is at work to solve your problems and the problems of all and to adjust situations. You look for and you give thanks for every act of mercy. You witness and you read and you, you are ever aware more in your consciousness of the justice of God, the mercy of God, and faith. You are displaying this faith when you begin to bring this up in your mind. And you are giving thanks in your mind that you're a part of the justice and kindness of the world. And as you do so, you are filled with a sense of oneness with God for all of God's people. And with God, you're in harmony with all. And all that harmony is another word for love.